we do. And unlike Engler, who was actually brought into the university to get the work done, now this next pick is expected to be someone who has worked with the university for more than for nearly two decades. Now, so far, what we know about this person is that his name, sources tell us, is Dr. Shatis Utpa, who has been with MSU since 2001. He currently serves as the executive vice president of the administrative services at MSU. Before that, he was the dean of college of engineering and chair of the electrical and computer engineering department. Now, he earned his Ph.D. in electrical engineering from Colorado State University. This morning, the Board of Trustees is expected to accept Engler's resignation and appoint UDPA. The resignation request by trustees came after Engler's comments that survivors are enjoying the spotlight. Survivors have long argued that Engler was not right for the university. Nasser victims who were not part of the university's original settlement with the first 333 survivors are planning to attend the meeting this morning. They believe their cases are not getting the attention they deserve after Engler's comments that MSU is done investigating NASA abuse reports. For his statements like that we are enjoying the spotlight um, are just absolutely degrading. Our students, we deserve a lot better. He's not very compassionate and nobody's really a fan of him here. So, I mean, I think we're glad that he's out. That meeting is expected to take place this morning at 8 o'clock at MSU, and we are expecting to stream that live on our website at WXYZ.com. Naya Harden, 7 Action News. A lot of people watching what will happen next. Without a doubt.